Alrighty, hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Huddocraft, and this is episode 2 of the Factions PvP, so I really hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, we didn't get that close to the 100 likes in the last episode, but I think that was because of the time I put it out, so I'm going to try and put it out a little bit earlier today, um, and hopefully we can get a few people on, and definitely uh, hit, those, hit the like button and get it up to close to 100, or over 100 again. Um, but hopefully today, if we can get over 100, I'm going to be doing a rank giveaway. I'm going to be giving away the lieutenant rank. So if you can drop your drop a comment with your name, uh, your in-game name, um, just so I know who I can uh, do the giveaway to. Um, but yeah, that would be awesome. Um, what you're looking at right here is the new hub. So I have a hub. This is currently being built. Um, there's a lot more things that are going to be added. So this is just kind of basically... Basically it finished, but we, so we got the factions kind of set up there, so you walk through here, then you go into the PvP faction spawn. Um, probably going to have prison on the other side over here, I'm not too sure how they're going to do it, because I've got a build team doing this all for me. Um, but yeah, so we've got eight portals in here, so that is room for expansion later on, so if you guys did have any ideas for me what other servers you would like to see uh, on the Huddocraft uh, network let me know because we got the PvP factions I have a prison being built right now which is going to go probably there or one of the ends and um, I wanted to have a hunger games in here maybe a kit PvP and uh, some other things I'm kind of stuck because I've got eight servers that I can get running on here so it's uh, it's kind of up to you guys if you want to let me know some ideas and I could pop some more servers in here uh, which would be very very cool and um, yeah so we'll have all this stuff here so you jump in here Huddercraft Network, this is created by the Infinity Box, which is kind of funny because we've got the Infinity Server. Um, a little bit funny there. Um, but yeah, these guys are awesome. Um, and they're going to be getting a lot more stuff built for me soon. So yeah, definitely drop a comment uh, with your in-game name. We'll be giving away that Lieutenant rank uh, next episode if we get 100 likes. And also drop a comment if you have any suggestions for some servers. So let's jump into factions. Alrighty, hey, we are over here in the factions. Um, swapped accounts, so yeah. <laughs> oh man, these guys are so funny. Um, yeah, this guy here, Hado, is that your old account or just a fan? I was like, well, everyone keeps asking me if I'm Jack. It's so funny, but a lot of people know that this is my alternate account, so I think it, it was obviously going to be, um, yeah, it was obviously going to be given away straight away, so I don't know, it doesn't really bother me, but whatever, it's all good. Um, over here at Spawn, a lot, a lot of people were asking about uh, what stuff we can get added to the shop. When's this going to get added? When's that going to add it? And I was like, you know what? I took two days off sick from work. So I worked on this shop and here it is, guys. We've got the, well, I did all this, so not we. I've got it upgraded. So you drop down here in the middle and then we've basically got every single block in the game added down here. Um, you can't buy everything yet because I didn't have time to go through and add all the bloody signs on because it takes so long. You literally have to manually place a sign to buy one, find the item code, how much you want to sell it for, blah, blah, blah. So it just took way too long. Um, I got these ones done just because I was just doing it while I was listening to some videos. Um, but pretty much got every block here. We got, I just put all the armor in just for something to do. So you got leather armor, wood there. I know people are... Uh, People probably won't buy that, but I've got all the gold stuff here. So that's for you, Herc, if you want to buy some. Chainmail, stone, uh, redstone side. Then I've just got all of the mob drops here. So all the mob drops pretty much. Um, everyone can sell leather and stuff like that. Everything here. So I want. I want. I need to buy some of these for my uh, faction in a second. Um, but I'm going to probably have to jump back and quickly put a sign on there and good to go. Um, all the building blocks here. Basically popped everything in there. So I've uh, got your bookcases and everything. So I know people... Um, I don't know whether you guys would like to have all these, like even bookcases and everything, but um, I'm not too sure. I've got all the dyes here and everything, like string and um, enchanting bottles and everything. Everything here, you can even buy furnaces, chests, crafting tables if you want. Uh, and a chest, I already got one, enchanting table, um, everything. So everything's here pretty much. And we also got upstairs as well, so... Um, let me know if there's something else that you want me to add. I've tried to add absolutely everything that I could. Um, within the space that I've got. Uh, so I think a lot of the other stuff is kind of not really that useful, whereas a lot of this stuff I've tried to keep it as useful as possible. Um, so yeah, I think I think it works. I think it's pretty good. Um, but I'm going to quickly head over to my home and show you guys what's going on. Um, 10 seconds, that's a long time. I don't know if we can shorten that to five, but I don't really know. But um, hopefully, because 10 seconds is, is way too long to wait to get teleported to your home. But here is my home. It's only very small for now. I'm going to extend it. I just wanted to get something very, very small for, for right now. Um, someone gave me some potions. 
So I've got a chest here full of potions. Just got some building stuff here, and then I've also got all my all my kind of good stuff in here. I've got potions here, I can move them out too. Excellent. Um, so I've got a chest full of potions, which is good. And I've got all my stuff here. Um, so golden apples and all my all my captain gear. So I'll probably do that again actually. Um, yeah, yeah, I can. Beautiful. Okay, let's um let's quickly sort this out while I while we're here. So I've got this is all protection three, so I'm going to try and arrange it in a in a in a nice fashion. This protection four, wow. Okay, do we get protection four with this kit? I didn't know that. That's making me happy. Protection four, holy shit, we do too. Wow. Okay, that's cool. I uh, did wasn't aware of that, but now I am. So we've got protection threes, protection fours. I might put the I might swap these over now. I'm not getting lag on the server like I like I used to, which is good. Oh, I just lost some boots there. Maybe I'm getting a bit of lag. I don't know. <laughs> Oh no, I just put it down here. Okay, cool. So protection threes. Um, I'll put the protection four over here actually. Just so I've got it all in a, all in a line. And I got another set of protection four on me as well, I'm pretty sure. So that's good. So I've got protection fours, protection threes, um, axes, bows, everything. I'm gonna have to start putting stuff in these chests here just because I've got way too much stuff on me. Um, oh, I need one of these, that one, because I was using it. Um, so what else we got in here? We've got these. These axes aren't really that good, so I might keep them out, but I'll put a couple of the swords in there because I don't really I don't really want people to have these swords because they are pretty OP. Um, and I don't really want someone to raid me and be able to take those, so I might take the bow out as well. Because those bows are crazy. That's good. And then I can probably put this back in here too. So that's good. That's basically everything that I don't really want to be stolen in here and on me. A couple of god apples there. And all this stuff here, so that's cool. Might quickly grab, whack, uh, get some of these happening, some furnaces, just so I got a big wall of furnaces, just so I can start cooking some stuff up in here. Um, how do you want to do this? Have I got wood in here? Let's just make all this wood. I'll pop chests everywhere, just so we can uh, we can get some stuff sorted. So I'm probably going to be opening this faction soon for possibly some uh, some people to join as well. Um, maybe people that I just kind of know, just so I can I can trust everybody because I don't really want this faction to get owned by people that I don't really trust I suppose I suppose I could probably trust all you guys but I know some people will just join just because it's my faction and they might give it away or something like that so I don't know I guess we'll have to see um, I put that in a bad spot and because I don't have silk touch can't move it so it's a pain in the bum uh, let's pop these all along here how many do I have I've got 16 so that's a lot and I'll pop all these down here and one more. Let's make two more just so it's even. I like being even. I've got a little bit of OCD about my life. So let's make two more real quick. And that should be good. And here we go. So we've got a wall of these. That makes sense. That's good for my life. And we've got chests there. And we'll probably whack some more chests over this side too. Whack some more over here. And we've got make another stack there. Cool. All right. That's looking good. And we we'll go like this. Put some torches around here. I think this is looking good. I don't really know. Is this a bad way to do it? Because people can... Oh, that's actually a bad idea, isn't it? Because people can access these if, you don't, if you're not able to put a block on them. So that's, uh, that makes sense. Because if you have a block on them, people have to break the block. Except if I put stuff in the middle ones, people can just open them. So, okay, that's, that's why. This is why I need your help. Because I don't know factions very well. And uh, little things like that I would have forgot. And someone could have came in here and easily raided my whole entire base and got everything. And that would have been a pain in the bum. But that looks better now. As soon as I can go along and uh, put a block on top of all of these. That means people cannot open them without... Like, I can't open them, obviously. Because it's a block on them. But that just means people can't open my chest because they can't break it. Because they're not in my faction. And that makes me happy. Because I know he will take my stuff. But, um... I'm going to probably quickly just run and grab some stuff for, uh for um, brewing, but I need to quickly jump on my other account, put some signs down and things like that, just so we know how much they are and everything. So I'll be back in a quick second. Alrighty, so we're over here. Just wanted to quickly show you guys, some of you guys may not be aware of how you set up the signs and everything like that. Maybe you're making your own server and you want to know. This is pretty much how you do it. So you find the item that you want. You can so you can search the, the ID of it. I just go in here and find it. It says it just there. So hashtag 0379. So the number of it is 379. This is 378, 377, 376. And these might be different. Yeah, 374s and stuff like that. So this is 379. So you go buy and one and then... 379, that's the item code, and then the amount. I don't know how much of these are, so I'm just gonna put it 100, because that seems like a pretty good price for it. 
Um, so then if you click buy on one, bam, you'll get it. And then the other way around, you just go exactly the same, but you put sell and then you put uh, one. So you want to sell one of them, 379. And then the amount you're selling for, I'll probably put them at 30 just because, I don't know, maybe you want to sell it. I have no idea why you'd want to sell one of those once you bought it, but I guess so I want to just keep it, keep it similar across the board. I want you to be able to basically buy and sell absolutely everything. Um, so that's kind of what you do. So for this next one, you'd go Colgen's 380. And so you have to go buy, uh, whoops, see and stuff up again. So then you go buy one, 380, and then maybe 50 for one of those. I have no idea. That seems a pretty good price, I guess. If you want me to change the prices, let me know and I can. Um, if you've seen them cheaper on another server or whatever. Um, so I guess it's like, you know, coals and stuff. See it cheaper on another server, we'll beat it by 10%. Um, <laughs> But that's 30, so we'll do it 50, so we'll do it for, you know, sell it for 20. I don't know why you want to sell it. Maybe there's a cheat way you can do it if you want to buy iron and make these sell them. I don't know. People will figure it out how to make good money on here, but that's pretty much how you do it. So you got those, and then, oh, I did buy down here. Okay. That is probably why I can't sell them. So this is uh, this is the issue that I've got, um, is it takes so long to do this. And um, it's, uh, yeah, it's crazy because I literally have to go through and manually type out every single one of these signs. Had some friends help me last time I did it um, for the upstairs shop and it took us like probably 20 minutes just to do this bit. And uh, downstairs is a lot bigger. So I'll probably see if I can grab those same friends over the you know, over like maybe tomorrow night um, or tonight after watching this to see if we can come through and just smash these signs out in an hour or so. Um, maybe the more people I can get on doing it, the better. So, um, yeah, see if I can hit people up on Skype and help me out and should be able to get it done. But yeah, let's, uh, jump back onto the other account and we'll come back and buy some of these things. Alrighty, here we are. So back over here, quickly head back over to spawn and we'll quickly grab how much money have I got? Oh, let me hang on. I'll show you a cool way of how we can check that. Whoop. Hello. Here we go. Hello, PvP Shane. Um, this is a quick way you can come down here and if you want to come down to the shop and you want to check how much money you've got Just right click on here balance Might be lagging a little bit. I have no idea right now Money So I've got 72,000 Wow, okay. I don't know how that much um, Holy shit. I did I did get money from the uh, I got 55,000 from this kit and then I already had 20,000 from ages ago that I gave my Sell some money to start off. Whoopsies. Uh, I might give some of that money back just because it's a lot too much, I think, to start off with. But um, yeah, I'm probably going to give a lot of that back just because I don't really need it all anyway. Uh, or I might do it a giveaway. I might give it a give it away. So, oh, let's buy a couple of these actually. How many should I buy? I might buy 10 just so we got a really good thing. I might buy 10 of these just in case. I don't really know what you really use these for. I guess make it look cool. I suppose we could do that. And nothing else we kind of need right now because I've got the potions and everything like that. Oh, actually, I kind of need to buy some stuff for, um, like brewing and shit like that. So let's uh, let's grab some stuff. It's on the other side, isn't it? Jump through here, we. And okay, so I want to grab, I want to grab a heap of these. I'm gonna grab like probably 64. I don't know why I haven't put this as 64. You got to click the shit out of it. Uh, but these are for health potions, so I'll probably grab like a heap of these. Maybe just 30 for now. I'll grab like a heap of these as well. I think these are for strength potions. Pretty sure. I'm not really. No, I'm not. I'm not sure actually at all. But I'm gonna grab a heap of them anyway, just because I know they're used for something. Regeneration or strength or something like that. And I know these are used for something too. So we'll just grab a heap of these too. We'll probably grab a heap of everything here. Um, I don't really know if I need the fermented spider, but I'm pretty sure that's for weakness or. So oh, this is for eight. Holy shit! I just bought so many of that. Whoops! I didn't see that. <laughs> I thought it was for one. Oh crap. Um, but I'll probably grab 30 of these as well. I'm pretty sure these are for weakness potions. So that'll be, uh, that'll be handy at the battlefield as well. And that's good there. Do we need anything else? Um, I don't need potions. I don't need any of this here. How much food have I got? I might grab some more food actually. I might just grab a heap of this food there. And cakes and things. Um, probably going to grab some of these too, just so I can start up my, um, uh, cocoa farm. And I'll probably grab some wood as well over here just so I can use it. Uh, this wood here. So we'll grab grab 64 of those that'll help us mock up some more of that actually that'll help us uh later on earn some money and anything else i need, I need a couple of buckets of water as well and i might buy some tnt as well i just spend all the cash 56 64 I might grab a couple of these as well all right that looks good i'm really happy with that so let's go back to f home and uh, i'm going to quickly grab some stuff i'll see who's online there's only a couple which sucks because I really want to do some PvP, but with not many people online because it's only a new server. Um, 
it makes it really, really difficult to do anything um, PvP-wise because there's not many people on, so it kind of sucks because I really, really, really want to PvP, but it doesn't doesn't always work out that way because there's not really that many people on, really, ever. Um, so if you guys want, like, and you guys want to kind of come on, have a play around, everything like that, like, the server's always up. Um, so if you guys want to come on and, and play, like, I would, I'd appreciate that so much um, if you guys come on and, and play because it means that we can PvP some more, means we might be able to get my videos out more um, and everything like that. So I'd um, actually love that, actually, if you did that for me. That'd be friggin' awesome. So come on if you can. Um, obviously, the uh, the IP and everything will be in the description, so I'd, uh, I'd super appreciate that. Like, you wouldn't believe if you come on and had a go. Um, but, yeah. Hopefully you guys can, because um, it'd be it'd be fun. Make it funner for me. Make it funner for the videos and everything like that, and make it a lot better. Uh, I'm gonna put my wood in this chest over here, just so I've uh, I've got ready to ready to go there. And I might. Where's the TNT stuff? Probably put the the raiding stuff over here in this corner, and that in there, and some buckets of water. Um, and then I'll probably pop some cauldrons down just here. I don't really know why I bought these cauldrons, but I guess just because. <laughs> Put these up here, I guess, in, in here, and we'll do that. And everything else can just go back in this chest here, so that's good. I think this space is looking good. I'm probably going to extend it out a little bit further, maybe this way, just because it's not much room in here, but I think it's good for, I think it's pretty good for a start here, so, um, yeah, if you guys do have any uh, any hints for me, any tips, please let me know, because I'm very, very new to factions, and I do want to learn, but I do need your help, um, so yeah, definitely let me know in the comments if you've got any tips or hints for me, or anything that I can kind of build around here that'll give me a bit of an advantage out in the, in the battle arena, um, let me know, and I'd really appreciate it, but that's going to about do it. So, um, yeah. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I really hope you guys can get behind this series. Um, I'm really wanting to start kicking it off, doing at least a video every day on this. Um, it's just that we had a few issues there at the start that I couldn't really record because I couldn't make a base and all this type of stuff. But Archie figured it out and fixed it all and we can use the portals now. We can use the nether, we can use the end. Um, all of the faction stuff should be complete in the next couple of days so you'll be able to battle the factions. Um, TNT Wars, everything like that, which I wasn't really too fussed about at the time because I hadn't really got around to it, um, actually doing the battles at the PvP, so it wasn't really too much of an issue for me, but I know a lot of people were a bit upset, but that should be fixed within the next couple of days, and um, yeah, really hope you guys are enjoying it, let's hit 100 likes and I'll do the uh, Lieutenant giveaway uh, next episode, so don't forget to comment down your um, in-game name and we'll, uh, we might get you a rank, which should be cool. And uh, don't forget, guys, I have added these uh, in as well. I haven't actually told you, but don't forget now. I'm telling you, we've got pig spawners here and also the uh, cow spawners here. So you can sell, buy and sell your beef over here. So you can buy and sell it over here. And, um, yeah, make, make a bit of money. And you've also got the uh, uncooked and cooked uh, pork chop here as well. So buy signs are gone. Someone broke them. I'll fix it up in a second. Um, but, yeah, that's awesome. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good weekend. And don't forget to watch my uh, single play video this afternoon. Catch you on the next one.